my weird little clover babies. I pulled these guys up from a yard and um, <clears throat> it was two different four leaf clover plants and they've been growing in this pot. So I had two four leaf clovers growing. And then this guy showed up. Where is he? Oh, there's a new four one. This guy, five. This was, this was my first five leaf clover. You can see he's really funny and wonky. So three in the front and then two in the back. So he doesn't open and close up with the perfect geometry like the, the three leaf ones. And then I put it outside because it got really leggy and wasn't growing a lot. And all these new little babies showed up. And then today I was looking at it because I've been trying to like figure out how to get rid of the buggies. So that's what that white stuff is, diatomaceous earth, which will deter. But... While I was looking, I noticed I have new babies. Okay, so this little guy, he's a five leaf. One, two, three, four, five. And poor little guy got ate up a little bit. But I'm glad the DNA is in the plant and it makes some cool anomalies. Like, here's one. Ah. Okay, so it's like, this is one that tried to be a three leaf clover, but the it has a Siamese leaf hard to show you but it's a Siamese leaf and then the little buggy guys boom and I just found <clears throat> let's see that's a three that's thinking about being a four that's their OG five leaf wait is that it yeah this is the OG five leaf okay and oh there's a baby new four leaf hello look at that <laughs> um yeah, that's all I see for today. But I got... <clears throat> this is such a poor quality. Okay. Let's see. All these little babies coming up. And I'm always so excited before they open. I want to know what they're going to be. But I got plenty of three leaves. <laughs> it's grown a lot better since I put it outside. 